Hello and what is up guys, my name is Wilson51 and today I'm going to be showing you how to um, insert a .sco file into a script network or a script. So what you're first going to need to do is, is you're going to have to get um, OpenIV or either Spark IV, um, they both do the same thing. And you're going to need a mod script, So and you're going to need a .sco, like from, well, .scos are basically mods. So you want to go on um, open, file open. Um, if you go on desktop, well, mine is in. Uh, I can look for it. There it is. That it is Chrome mods. Um, script and open that up. Uh, yes. And now some some mods um, have at least ten mod slots in their mods, and uh, mine does have ten. I think it goes up to fifteen. I'm not very sure. But then um, most mods don't um, have this thing in their mods called mods. One dot sco. So if you don't have it, um, you want to make one, and yeah. So uh, most mods like um, evades. Um, well, I think it's only evades. I'm not sure. It's um, usually mod one dot sco, for example. But then um, if you're using Chrome's, it's mods one dot sco. So what, whatever mod you've got, you want to rename it and um, drag it into your Spark I <coughs> Spark I <coughs> yeah Spark IV. So guys and put it in there and it should be right in there now after you've um, put all your mods in you want to make sure you do rebuild it or it will not save so rebuild and once it's rebuilt after like a minute it's usually quicker than that but then once it's finished um, you close it down and your script will have so yeah it's not, not in that file your script will have all the mods that you inserted in and um, if you go on like for, for example Chrome's is in MISC and if you go on uh, mod slots um, all your mods should be there and if you can um, click on them they open up so yeah um, simple and short video guys in here um, hope this helped you out and yeah peace out